Hello, 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 everyone. Hello, world. This is again Alex tuning in and EU's Marketplace News. And for today, I'm going to give you hot topics, the latest news, and of course, a reminder for the Crypto Games Conference. Okay, stay tuned. So, I hope you're doing great today. So, just sit back and relax because I will be giving you a lot of information for today. All right, so topics for today for breaking news and in depth. Uh, I'm in depth for a look at the Keep Key cryptocurrency hardware wallet. Okay, now in addition, I will be sharing to you again some websites that you can benefit with, and of course, about the Crypto Games Conference updates. All right, so stay tuned, guys. Okay. Now, first things first, I want to um, give you a disclaimer because, guys, here in EOS Marketplace News, um, we are not financial advisors, all right? We are just here to give you information and updates about EOS and other currencies. So, I would like to make it clear, guys, that you need to make your own research or you need to do your own research about the tokens or coins that we already mentioned in our videos or that we will be mentioning in our videos, okay? So, you do your own research and then you can decide after, okay? You decide for yourself. All right, now, maybe right now you are thinking, um, why am I even watching this video? Why am I hearing these things? simply because you are interested right and you want to know more about cryptocurrencies eos bitcoins and other currencies okay so let me help you with your research and let me help you decide okay but i'm not suggesting that you need to invest on any other uh, currencies or any specific currencies okay now let's start um, for our breaking news today, it's brought to you by PCN or Preferred Currency News. An in-depth look at the KeepKey cryptocurrency hardware wallet. Wow, look at this one, guys. Okay, now let me give you the details. Um, keeping cryptocurrency safe is a fundamental part of participating in the digital com economy. And hardware wallets have become popular security solutions. These days, there is a slew of devices on the market, each with its own options and features. One of these is the KeepKey Wallet, a product that's been well received by digital currency investors over the last three years. Okay, now the KeepKey Hardware Wallet. Um, Earlier this week, I took a look at the Keep, um, Keep Key Hardware Wallet, a device that allows users to store multiple crypt, um, cryptocurrencies in a secure fashion. So Keep Key is sold for um, 129 US dollars per device. Now, which is more expensive than the Ledger Nano, Cool Wallet S, and Tracer One? Now, nevertheless, the small rectangular device is more pleasing to hold and the screen looks very nice when the keep key is operating. The case the keep key comes in is package well and resembles in an open Apple product. Keep key, cool wallet, and the ledger all have well packaged boxes compared to Trezor One packaging. Look at this one, you guys. Here, this is the Keep Key hard wallet. Now, Keep Key's um, pin system is identical to the Trezor entry method. Here, numbers are displayed on the device, and the user has to submit the order on the Keep Key clients on screen in pin pad. Right. For example, your um, Keep Key um, pin is five two four. 329, right? Okay. Now, the black keep key box is sealed in plastic wrapping, and when removed, there's also a piece of tamper resistant tape holding the box closed. After inspecting the tape and making sure the box has not been opened previously, a knife is needed to cut the tape's seal. 
So inside the box is a keep key, a 12 word seed card, a USB cord, and some warranty information. The keep key is a plastic anti-scratch film laid over the um, laid over the device's screen and is encased in black foam. Keep Key's large OLED screen is pleasing to look at and is probably one of the device's best features. After opening the Keep Key, I headed over to the company's Getting Started page and downloaded the Keep Key application for Google Chrome. Keep Key only works with Chrome, but it's the same with most har um, hardware wallets now, okay? So you can use the browser Google Chrome or Chrome. All right. Connecting to Chrome and initializing the seed. Okay, guys, watch this. After installing the application to Chrome, the platform asks you to plug your key key in to get started. Immediately after initiating the key key, it required a firmware update and would not start the process of initiating a seed until the firmware was downloaded into the device. Removing the USB cable from my keep key was an uncomfortable feeling and it took a bit of force to insert and remove the cord compared to other devices. Ledger Na Nano is probably the best as far as connecting the cord with the Trezor 1 following behind my Trezor device has always had a weird connection feeling as well. However, after using the USB connection a few times with the keep key, Connecting was easier and got much more comfortable to insert over time. Here, main account, BCH, Dodge, settings. Okay, now overall, the Keep Key user interface is fairly intuit uh, intuitive and easy to navigate. Well, friendly, user friendly. N moving on, the Keep Key begins by initiating a new device name, seed and pin. The program makes you double check the pin twice and then asks you to write down the seed phrase, which is located on the device itself. Unlike other hardware wallets, the keep key does not require you to double check the 12 word phrase. So after this process, you are granted access to the first account, which is dedicated to BTC. In order to add cryptocurrencies, there is a drop-down menu that allows users to add BCH, Dodge, LTC, ETH, plus a range of ERC-20 tokens. Okay, transactions, shapes, shift, and comparisons to other models. Unlike other hardware wallets, KeepKey needs to be plugged into view accounts and they can't be seen when the device is disconnected. After the initial seed has been set up, I created a Bitcoin Cash or BCH wallet to send myself some funds. Anytime I test a new wallet, I always send a small fraction of crypto just to make sure the application is working properly. The wallet immediately saw the transaction. You can view confirmed and unconfirmed transactions in a separate window that's tethered to a block explorer. Here I think this is um, the picture that explains briefly. Now, keep key transactions can be viewed in a separate window and search with the platform's um, tethered block explorer. Here guys, um, the keep keys interface is fairly intuitive and you can change things like the pin or use wallets in client shape shift option within the settings section. Sending and receiving is simple and the actual device itself is used for signing verification while also showing sending or receiving addresses on the screen as well. Here. Right, it is a cute um it is a cute um sort of thing, right? And I think it's very handy. So this is good. Keep key shows account addresses on the device screen. Following the transaction, I decided to look at the client's um, shapeshift integration. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry. Keep key is owned by the firm Shapeshift AG and was one of the first hardware wallet to offer trading abilities within the wallet. 
Recently, however, Shapeshift has changed the platform's business model to a membership exchange, and all keep key users have to register using the client. All right, guys. So this is really a good information about keep key so if you want to try then go ahead all right now in addition keep key users can use a shape shift in wallet but have to register for the company's membership program and verify their identity in order to trade the required items needed to use a shape shift include a verified email and the user must submit a photo id to trade Yes, for, you know, transactions, you need to verify whether it's really you or not, right? So all of these tasks can be done through the KeepKey client and a quick email verification. After the account is processed, you can trade on the Shape Shift Exchange in Wallet using the quick or precise trading options. Overall, the KeepKey operates fairly smoothly and I didn't really have any problems throughout the setup and funding the device. The KeepKey's user interface is more comfortable to move um, to move around and use than Ledger Nano and KeepKey operates similarly to the Trezor one. Unlike the Trezor or Ledger, the KeepKey uses one button navigation but still works fluidly with the wallet's task like sending and receiving. The device doesn't have support for too many cryptocurrencies right now, and other products offer a greater selection. But, as far as the coins it does hold, the Keep Key offers an easy-to-use operating system and is just as secure as its competitors by using similar OPSEC techniques. All right, so guys, what do you think about the Keep Key hardware wallet, okay? If you want to comment, just comment on the video below, okay, on the comment section, of course. All right, so, um, everyone, that's the news for today. And again, it's brought to you by PCN, Preferred Currency News. So, if you want to be the first to get notified, um, you can subscribe to PreferredCurrency.News using your preferred method here. You can use PayPal for monthly recurring only $15 per month fiat or you can use the Coinbase, all right? And if you want to pay annually or yearly, it's only $180 subscription to be paid with crypto, all right? So guys, if you will visit preferredcurrency.news, then you can have this site. And if you don't want to read information, you just want to focus or watch video, um, there are videos that is available on the website. You, you just need to click this one, one of these videos, and then it will take you to the right path or to the right channel in YouTube, right? Okay, so you can contact us, um, Donald Lewis, Donald, uh, Donald the Guru, okay his information is here available now of course you you um you need to put your name here you fill in this form your email that's both required of course right then subject is not really required as long as you put your message all right then just hit send okay so um there are subscribers that gave their testimony um, testimonials let's try to read at least one let's just say a testimony from Jessa Junia or Hunia excellent this website is very helpful to me every day this website helps me be updated about the top trending coin or coins of the day it lessens the hassle of watching and reading updates from the social media networks with the gathered information or opinion from the social media networks helps me identify what altcoin or crypto should I be alert with. Thank you so much, Preferred Crypto new, dot News. Wow. All right. So, guys, again, don't forget to subscribe. Um, preferred Currency dot News. Okay. I will be sharing the links and the websites on, on the information box later on. Okay. So, moving on. Guys, 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 I want to remind you about the Crypto Games Conference 
That will be on October 17 and 18 in Minsk, Belarus. Okay, together we create games, community, and the future. Guys, there are only um, three days left. Am I in a yeah, three days left. Okay, so if you uh, if you did not buy any tickets, you can visit the website now. Okay, you can buy tickets here. Buy tickets, or you can give your sponsorship. Now there will be six hundred plus professionals joining, one hundred plus gaming brands, sixty five plus speakers, and twenty five plus countries. Okay, here, Danny, Masaru, Jenny, Alexander, Kostantin, Thomas, Dimitri, Vladimir, Andre. Well, so these are the speakers that will be joining us in the conference. Okay, so guys, you can become a speaker. Okay, just click, um, just click this link. <coughs> Excuse me. Excuse me. Um, just click this link and it will take you to this side. Okay. Now, crypto games. Okay, sorry. Okay. Speaker application here. Oh, what's happening? I'm not signed in. Okay, let's sign in. Um. Okay, let's go back here first. Okay, for guys, for tickets here, for business tickets, there, uh, there are only thirty-three, uh, thirty-three tickets left. So for business, you can have all sessions, expo zone, breaks, coffee, delegate bag, full badge, networking events, full access to meeting system, business lounge, and pitch and match. And for standard ticket, there are only 25 left. So if you want to buy, buy now. All sessions, expo zone, coffee breaks, delegate bag, name only, networking events, limited access to meeting system. And of course, the I think, uh, yes, the cheapest ticket will be the Indy. So there are only 19 left. So guys, um, buy now. You can have the all sessions, expo zone, coffee breaks, delegate bag, name only. And then you can just click, 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 get tickets. Okay, so the prices are available. For business tickets, it's um, only 250 euros. Standard, 150 euro. And indie, 50 euros. Okay, and you will have... Oh, update! You will have... Um, you will have the opportunity to get information, to enjoy the conference, and be or and be with other con uh, I mean participants, right? Uh, meet new friends. Wow! So this will be very exciting. Okay, here sold out, sold out. Wow! So prize policy early bird. Before August 31, it's already sold out. Premium Pass, Standard, and Indie. Um, for regular, September 1st is... Okay, September 30, it's already sold out. Now, guys, Late Bird. It's not yet... Uh, it's still available. It's not yet sold out. Here, October 1st until October 18. Okay, so these are uh, these tickets are available. Now, return until seven days before the event. So, I'm sure no one will turn the ticket because every one of us like to um, like to attend, right? Okay, now here, um, if you want to be a speaker again, you can send an application because um, the Crypto Games Conference are putting together a lineup of speakers for the Crypto Games Conference held in Minsk, Belarus. On October 17 and 18, 2018. Topics for discussion. Take note. Design and development of games and gaming products and services using blockchain and cryptocurrencies. Preparing for and running of a successful gaming ICO. Marketing and promotion. Regulation, compliance and licensing. Roundtables to discuss crypto gaming related matters. Now, guys, here. 
Listen out. The approved speaker is provided with a free premium pass to the Crypto Games Conference. The number of speakers is limited. Okay, so guys, free premium pass. Wow. Okay, so these are the uh, information that is required. All right. Email address, name. Tell about um, tell us about yourself, your company, position, track record, achievements, and accolades. Your talk is about what? And then title of your talk, main thesis of your talk, links. And guys, if you will um, submit the photo, please only excellent quality. Okay? Please add a storage link with a free access and then click submit. All right. So, guys, what are you waiting for? Join now, okay? You have three days left. I mean, two days, I think. Three or two days. Yes. So, just visit the website, Crypto Games, that events for more information. All right? Okay. Now, um, guys, please, um, it is really important to be updated um, with this kind of events or what are the current updates and news about cryptocurrencies or any specific currencies right so if you want to get updated and if you want to know the latest news subscribe now at preferredcurrency.news all right so um that would be all for tonight's video thank you so much for watching and this has been alex signing off bye